born and raised Los Angeles, all the way from Carson, Torrance, Hermosa Beach, Manhattan Venice, Beach. Manhattan, Inglewood, Compton, kind of all, all around the place. <laughs> and then um, we all kind of met at the beach. Uh, you know, we surf and skate and we used to do a lot of graffiti and, you know, a lot of stuff like that. The idea of Tomorrow's Bad Seats comes from an old school graffiti crew back in 1994 yep. that he helped start with a couple of my cousins and a couple other friends. We just kept using that name because people in the neighborhood already knew about it and it kind of helped, you know, yes. kind of pulled us into a little spot of kind of already known name, you know. Ran around the unfamiliar sound of love lost in vain. Girl, the love's not the same. And oh, she burned it down, burned it down. great history in this place and it's it's really cool for us as musicians and friends to be able to yeah. leave our history or our some kind of mark here as well. And we also you know? just come, like we come here to like eat dinner all the time and we know yeah, Mark really actually, well. Yeah, we've here he lots comes of to times. our shows at House of Blues so like we used to have our meetings here. You got me running around this town looking for that unfamiliar sound. You gotta remember that you're you're conveying a message to a audience, regardless of whether they're taking it serious or not. And your choice to put something positive in there, something they can take away, whether it's you know be righteous to your fellow human being, or whether it's show love and compassion, you know, or just like telling stories, story. you know, just telling stories of Related. things that help you up to relate to other to people. Get through you know? this thing we call life, <laughs> straight up. <laughs> Tupac on that, Black Street, all that stuff. Keep it going for hours. <laughs>